today we are in New Orleans. No, we're not. We're in Louisiana, though. So officially in Louisiana, heading to New Orleans. So that's super dang, dang cool. In fact, first we're stopping a place called Morgan City to do a food challenge. So the food challenge is called the Big Skinny. It's a place called Eastgate Barbecue. So this Big Skinny challenge is 24, it'd make a 24 inch long barbecue sandwich, kinda. Um, so it's being made with, I believe, like three eight inch uh, po' boy sandwich bread thingy things filled with a pound of pulled pork, pound of brisket. You have two pounds of delicious burger patties cooked over wood. Then you have like vegetables, and blah, 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 all this delicious stuff. Then you have a serving of fries on the side. We have one hour and 45 minutes to complete it. Yes, it is right, 105 minutes to complete it. If we do, we get the meal for free and a sweet t-shirt. If not, we gotta pay for it. There's only been one winner in over nine years and there has been about 50 attempts. So it's not very good odds. It's pretty bad odds, to be honest. But anyway, wish us luck, fingers crossed. Let's go eat some food. Delicious barbecue. I can smell it from here and I love barbecue. So Louisiana barbecue, let's go. In America, there's a bottle to burn and a fire to light. You ain't done nothing if you did it halfway. If you're gonna raise hell, then you better damn rain. Alright everybody, so here we are with the challenges. Looks absolutely delicious. Total weight's about seven pounds. Um, we do have one hour and 45 minutes, so 105 minutes to complete this. Reyna, yes. are you ready? And then for my hair, and then we will be. Mine's already up, you know I'm ready to rock. I love barbecue, so delicious, so excited. We got a large variety of different sauces as well. So we'll get started, say the count of five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. After all, mmm. Hold on. Meat. This is my kind of challenge. And they cook the burgers over wood as well. Hey everyone, welcome to this video where today we're at Eastgate Barbecue eating some oh, delicious, delicious barbecue. So they advertise it as a Texas barbecue with a Louisiana twist, and I definitely think that is an accurate representation. So here we're doing the Great Big Skinny Challenge, and yes, I say Great Big because this is a big. I like it. Smoky, delicious. So as we mentioned, there were definitely some poor odds on this challenge. Like, I mean, one out of fifty guys. That's pretty. You know, that's pretty. It's not great, not like at all. Um, but that being said, uh, we were really hoping to change that to become winners two and three. Um, hopefully, you know, but hey, we'll see what, of course, what's going to happen. Um, so as I mentioned, you get a whole bunch of pulled pork, there's a whole bunch of brisket, then there is some burger patties. Man, I will say these are some delicious burgers. Love that they were cooked over wood. It really does, you get the flavor, like a wood grill. Um, oh my gosh, amazing. And they cooked them perfectly. I wanted my burgers like a medium rare, and they were just like fantastic. I could not have asked for a better cooked burger at all. I get that brisket. Ooh, that delicious fatty brisket. I'm gonna try some of these delicious sauces. All the meats were juicy, which was great. Um, they also kind of had uh, like some cabbage on the sandwiches as well, which I liked. Like some places, you know, would try to put lettuce or something on here, but cabbage was very suiting. It kind of, you know, it, although it wasn't sauced like a coleslaw, kind of added that aspect to it, that little bit of almost like uh, bitterness from the cabbage, which goes really well with those nice savory meats. And then, of course, add a little bit of crunch and texture. Um, there's also cheese on the sandwich as well. Um, and then here we had a number of different sauces in front of us. Um, like literally they have four or five, six different kinds of sauces and we literally got to try them all. And um, they had like a traditional kind of red sauce, which I really, really liked. Um, and they had a, a, a regular one, which I really liked as well, but all were just great. And hopefully I'm gonna try some other items after. I see some dessert up there, I have my eye on it. Good, like huge sandwich sauce. So that meat. You can also like order this as a challenge, so. Dude, these burger patties are really good. Yeah, everything's delicious. Other nice thing is that the breads were soft. Um, so again, this is kind of like the po' boy uh, sandwich bread. So we had basically like three big massive po' boys, but with like, you know, way more meat than normal. But they did say you could order, I don't recall um, what it was called. I don't know if it'd be a special order, but you could like get like one of these on the menu. Um, and he said most people couldn't even finish one of them. 
Um, and I can see why. I mean, there's a whack of meat on them. Like, but again, all delicious meat. Of course, I love brisket. I love pulled pork. I love that smokiness, that barbecue, and this definitely satisfied that. We also had about, about a pound of French fries, um, which was, I mean, it was a good serving. Uh, the fries were solid, no complaints about them. Um, but yeah, I think that's, you know, the majority of the info kind of about the food itself. Again, trying the different sauces, um, the different flavors, but it really didn't need much of a sauce. Again, everything was just very, very delicious tasting. And uh, yeah, I mean, hey, I had no complaints in flavor wise. This sauce is, I don't know what the flavor is, but it's very good. Mm. Oh, you getting that, that pork in there now? That brisket? Mm. Just that smoke. Woo wee! So this in totality was my overall first time in Louisiana and then uh, to stop in Morgan City was pretty cool. Um, it's a cool little spot, definitely a smaller town, quaint town. Uh, from my understanding a lot of kind of like gas and oil workers and a lot of that gas and oil happening in that location. Um, but yeah, hey, so I think it was, it was a cool little spot. Um, Eastgate here was definitely a great restaurant. Definitely would recommend if you're ever in the Morgan City area. And then like I said, they do have a little um, shop. Uh, also, it's it's not like, I think it's more like a takeout um, pickup location in Lafayette or like just outside of Lafayette, um, Louisiana. So yeah, hey, I definitely recommend checking out. It's a solid spot. Um, again, I think the description that they used is accurate. It's kind of like a Louisiana twist on Texas style barbecue. So you definitely get kind of that uh, more traditional kind of just salt and pepper cook on like, let's say the brisket. Um, some reminiscence of a Texas style barbecue, maybe a little lighter on the smoke, and then some influence from that Louisiana side. Dude, the meat is good. I told you. If we didn't finish the meal, I believe it was $70 or $80. Um, so again, hopefully we're going for that win. You do have 105 minutes. So it, I think uh, it is a generous um, time limit, I guess we'll say. But that being said, I mean, it is like probably about seven, seven and a half pounds of food. I don't, th yeah, I'd say, I'd say seven, seven and a half pounds of food. So it is a lot of food, don't get me wrong. Um, I mean, one out of 50 attempts, that goes to show the difficulty of it, but it is nice that they give you, I mean, really, an hour and 45 minutes. So, if you're a big eater, you like barbecue, hey, who knows, maybe you'll uh, have to swing on by. But with that, everybody, I will let you get to the rest of the inf or the rest of the video. Hope you enjoy. That's all the information I have to give you. But yeah, some uh, delicious taste in barbecue. I love barbecue, you guys know that. And, oh, one quick thing. Alright, so I'm done my last sandwich and then the fries. Raina is got all her burgers done. She's making her way through everything. They're both doing really well. Lots of time left, and it's very delicious. Very much enjoying it. But before I officially sign off, everybody, let me know real quick down below in a comment what your favorite kind of barbecue is. What's your favorite kind of meat? Mine's brisket. Hashtag beef. Team beef. Let's see what you guys are. We got team beef, team pork, team chicken. Let me know down below. And of course, if you're enjoying the video, please give it a like. Consider subscribing. And with that, everybody, I'll let you get to the rest of the video. Let's see if we can get some wins and let's go.
probably coming on about nine minutes in. Very delicious. Very much enjoying the flavors. I just had some fries left. Very nice moisture meat gone. There'll just be buns left for her. And fries left for me. Roughly 95 minutes left. If you want my sauce. Just clean up some of the shrapnel and we'll be done. Leave it done, and we are done. Probably maybe like 11, just over 11 minutes. Very, very delicious. Range just down to the bread. Make a good time. Now we have two winners in nine years. Soon to be three, hopefully. I have faith. So maybe about 14-ish minutes in, Reyna is just down to her bread. She loves to stack her breads like that and stack everything like that, so call it a burrito. And uh, yeah, I like that's a good sauce, eh? Mm -hmm. I think it's the original and they have like a red sauce. Delicious, both excellent flavors. All right, Reyna down to her last bites. Maybe about 19 minutes in. There we go. She's getting her done. Did you drink it? Just finished up, just shy of 20 minutes. Congratulations, Reyna. Thank you. So very delicious challenge. We both beat the big skinny. You can call me big, call her skinny, it works. So yeah, very delicious, absolutely loved it. Reyna can't speak highly enough about those burger patties. I absolutely agree. That brisket on there, got some good, juicy, moist, fatty brisket. Absolutely love it. So yeah, if you're ever in Morgan City, definitely stop, stop up by Eastgate here. Absolutely loved it, great food. They also have a little location just outside of Lafayette. So for that, we give them up for free. Super delicious. We are now winners two and three out of about 50 attempts over nine years. So we just really did increase the odds of winning. It was one out of 50, now it's three out of 50. Rana, any words? Three out of 51, dum dum. Three out of 50, now two attempts if you want to go from there. Anyway, at that, everybody, thanks so much for watching. Huge thanks to staff, very kind here, and the crowd. People here have just been super hospitable. It's like that Southern hospitality. So until next time, everybody, stay happy, healthy, hungry, happy eating. You know what to do. Come get yourself some food and have a lovely day. We're eating dessert. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. We'll be back.
Hi everyone, and just afterwards, gonna try some of their fatty brisket individual. Look at it, it's steaming nice and nice and hot. I love brisket, so this is a, this is a big, 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 thick chunk. Definitely excited to try some brisket and try some quang. I'll cut right in a piece. Yeah, look at the look at the nice thickness on that. The fattiness, that juice. Delicious. Wow, oh, yeah. it just falls apart. Wow. Nice and juicy. It just falls. I'm going against the grain just so I can get rid of both <clears throat> both sections of it. The fat in between the two. There you go. You want color? <laughs> I was like, he just took the fork away. <laughs> mm. Oh yeah. Mm. That bark got some salt, some pepper. Mm. Quite uh, nice and smoky, Let, lighter smoke. Yeah, Fats very well rendered. Yeah. Some delicious meat. <laughs> If I could, I'd eat barbecue seven days a week. No shame. All right, we got some dessert. Randy got some uh, bread pudding. I got some house-made cheesecake. It looks delicious. Chocolate chip. So you have to try this. The bread pudding? I'll try it. I'll take a bit Sorry. Mm. Ooh. Chocolate chip cheesecake. Ooh. Mm. That's delicious. It really... It really tastes like a cookie. Like you got a real nice cookie aspect to it. This bread pudding is really good. It's uh, warm, I like it. I'm gonna try Rain's bread pudding. Alright, right, gonna try some bread pudding. Gotta dip in some of this rum sauce. Looks like some pecans in there too. Oh yeah, this looks real good. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, that's really good. It's pecans, it's sweet. Mm. It's almost like maple. Oh, that's fantastic. With that warm bread pudding? Yeah. A lady recommended that and I see why. Very, very delicious. Mm. Well, there you go everybody. Eastgate, Morgan City. Ten tell we recommend. So everybody, till next time. Have a lovely life. Have a lovely day. Mm. Have a blessed day. There's a more south same. Till next time. Shake it for me, girl, shake it for me, shake it for me.